and welcome to the beauty cube it's Carla today's look is going to be Steelers inspired because they're going to the Super Bowl I'm going to do both teams but today it is um, solely black and yellow <laughs> really simple look that you can accomplish um, I have a lot of Steelers fans in my family so they were really excited to see this look um, the colors that I'm using is just really simple colors um, if you have an 88 or a 120 palette, go into this dark yellow, just that darkest yellow that I have, and then I'm going in with um, my Wet n Wild palette, um, just this shimmery black right here. Um, I'm just taking my time. You could use tape and put tape along here and do that and then peel it off to give you that um, dramatic cat eye effect, or you can just take your time and blend as well um, a listing of all products will be on the beautycube.blogspot.com you can go there and check it out um, if you have any questions definitely feel free to leave a comment or video response below and I'll talk to you guys later bye hey guys um, first you want to start by priming your eyes using your Jessie Girls primer and you just want to put that all over the lid Next, I'm going to go in with my Jumbo Jumbo Pencil from NYX, and this is in Milk. It's just an all-white color, and I'm going to just put that on the actual lid part. I'm not going to take it up. I'm just going to put it on the actual lid. You can dab it on, and then I use my ring finger, and I'm going to go in and blend that. just like that until you have it nice and blended. Now, with just a flat shader brush like that, go into this yellow. And we're gonna pack it all over the lid. So once that yellow color is placed, I'm going into my Wet n Wild palette in Greed. You have two blacks, but I'm going to be using the more sparkly black right here. And just take another flat shader brush or any shadow shader brush that you have. Dab into the color. Make sure you tap off any excess to prevent fallout. And I'm going to dab this in the outer corner right here now for this being black you really want to take your time um, I would recommend little by little just little steps at a time just don't go throwing the color on there otherwise you can mess up so just take your time place the color blend um, I'm gonna have it sped up so you can kind of see me do it but what I'm doing is I'm going in with this brush right here which is my flat shader brush I'm going in with a pointed sig this is a Sigma well it's named something else but it's just a Sigma fluffy brush like a two two one seven like brush and then another two one seven to help blend so that's what I'm gonna do um, but all I'm using is just this color right here three different brushes to bring the color up and then blend the color over
Okay. <laughs> so you have your color placed. Really simple. You just have to take your time to really get that the cat pointed eye like doing like that. You can use tape, um, but I just did it freehand to show you just taking your time you can do it. But you can use tape if you'd like and if you want it sharper, I just have a towelette and I wrap my finger around it and you just go over here to make that edge even sharper. Now I'm going to double back and go back into my yellow just to make that pop because when you blend you do use, lose some of that yellow. So I'm just going to go back into that yellow and bring that back kind of to life. There you go. And then if you need to go back with the that black and just blend that again you can no problem there here you go so after that you're pretty much done all you need to do is add your favorite liner I'm going in with my carbon black liquid liner from L'Oreal it's my all-time favorite liner and you want to get in close and line your lash line your lash line Okay. Next I'm going in with my new favorite, my Revlon Color Stay liner, pencil eyeliner. I'm going to line my waterline. And then my tight line. going to curl my lashes. And I'm going in with my L'Oreal Telescopic. This is in blackest black. And then I'm going in with my Grow Luscious from Revlon. So there you go, your Steelers inspired look for the big game. Um, really simple. I like it. Something that is definitely dramatic that you can wear to the party. Um, if you wanted to go get one of the temporary tattoos, you could put like the that something like right on one eye to dress it up a little. So that'll be really fun. Um, if you, I hope you guys tried this look. If you're a Steelers fan and you're going to a party, this is definitely a great look for Super Bowl. So I hope you guys have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye.